We have a 15 minute cool down today. It's important to do a cool down after every workout to relax, cool down your body and return your muscles to their resting length. Start by standing upright, then bend forward touching the mat with your fingers, then raise up halfway, then back to the mat again. Then bring your arms all the way up, ending with your hands to the center. And we'll repeat the sequence a couple of times. You can keep a slight bend on your knees if you're not as flexible. It's okay. Now get into a downward dog position. You can walk your legs to loosen up your calves. Stay here for a little bit and relax. downward dog we are going into a high plank then lowering down into an upward dog then back into a downward dog make sure you do it slow and control you don't want to hurt your back if you can't do an upward dog then you can skip the move adjust it based on how you feel Now from downward dog position, we are going into a high plank. Then bring one leg to the side of your hands. You can lower down your elbows to the mat if you're flexible enough. If not, you can stay where you are. And now use your hand to push your knee out slightly and hold there. Now we are going to do hamstring stretch by shifting your hips back with your back leg bent at 90 degrees, front leg straight and front foot flexed. Then try to lower your upper body as low as you can. I'm not quite flexible so I can't really go all the way down so please do what your body allows you to do. You don't want to overdo it and hurt your hamstrings. Now fold one of your leg inward and have the other straight then we're gonna stretch our lats and the side of our body. Try to touch your foot with your hand and if you're not quite flexible just bring your arms over. It's okay, you'll get there. I'm trying to improve my flexibility as well. Now we are going to fold forward stretching our hamstrings again. Take it nice and slow and don't push it too hard. Ease into the move and be patient and do what your body allows you to. Now we are going to do the same on the other side. Go back into a downward dog and then into a high plank. 
and bring the other leg to the side of your hand. And if you are flexible enough, then get down on your elbows and push your knee out with one hand and hold there. Now we're gonna do hamstring stretch on this leg. Have your back leg bent and front leg straight and front foot flex. Go as low as you can without hurting yourself. Know your limits. Now fold your leg inward and the other straight and stretch the side of your body. Take it nice and slow. Now we're stretching our hamstring again by folding forward. Go as slow as you can, don't rush it. It's okay if you're not as flexible. Now sit upright and we're going to rotate our head. Do it clockwise first and make sure you do it slow and controlled. You don't want to pull the muscle from stretching. Try to relax. Now and tie clockwise. Take it easy and relax. Now we're gonna do some shoulder rolls. Roll your shoulders forward first. Take it easy. Now roll your shoulders backwards and try to relax. Now let's stretch our arms, hold your left arm straight and use your right arm to pull it across your chest and hold for 30 seconds. Now do the same on the other side.
Now get into a downward dog, then into a high plank, then into a pigeon pose. You can hold here for a little bit and slowly easing yourself into a deeper stretch by folding forward. Hold here for 30 seconds. This is a really great stretch, especially after a leg or booty workout. Lift your chest up and bring your back leg up and stretch your quads. Hold here for 30 seconds. Back into a downward dog, then into a high plank, then bring one leg in folded into a pigeon pose and hold here. Then chest up and bring your back leg up and stretch your quads and hold. Relax. Now get back up and stack your foot on top of the other leg almost parallel and then fold forward. This is a really good stretch for your butt. Now put the other foot on top, then fold forward and stretch the other butt cheek. If you can't go as deep, it's fine, take your time. Now lay down, have one knee bent and bring it to the other side, hold it down using your hand and then hold there. Now do the same on the other side and try to relax.
that's the cooldown guys i hope you are feeling relaxed remember to eat well and be nice to yourself and i'll see you in the next workout bye